Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron here. Great little book. I'm about, I don't know, quarter of the way through it by John Jeffries Martin, professor of history at Trinity University. This is put out by uh, John Hopkins University. And it's Venice's hidden enemies. And it's about heresy in Venice, Italy, the Venetian Republic there, which had such a big influence on the United States, as a matter of fact, and their thinking processes and republicanism. And Italian heretics in a Renaissance city. Fantastic. Let's see what page I'm on. I'm on page 54 out of 297. That's including general index, which starts page 273. And uh, that type of thing. But it is just fantastic. I'm learning so much about Italian history. I'm learning about, and see, that's where micro history, sometimes we tend to do mountain peaks of history and just say everybody in Italy was Catholic. Well, that's just patently not true. First of all, there really wasn't an Italy till, well, what was it in the 1870s under King Victor Emmanuel and stuff? It was a, a broken up into tons of fiefdoms. It's been said Italy is still a lot of dialects and all Piedmontese and all this. And uh, But you had things like Venetia, or Venice, excuse me, that uh, Merchant of Venice with Shakespeare that just had so much in it and so much uh, Reformation ideas, but not just Reformation ideas, but biblical ideas. And so like Okino was there. A lot of people, you know, I'm apostolic, one that's Pentecostal. And so, you know, you see all these people that are believing kind of similar to what our understanding of Scripture is as well. So... You know, when people say, well, the apostolic church died out. Friend, this is just one city of thousands around the world. And you find that there were people that were not in tune with the popular religion of the day, which was Catholicism, and that were very much into Biblicism. And so it's a very well-written, it's a rather technical book, but I'm enjoying it immensely. And if you have a chance to get it, John Jeffries Martin, Venice's Hidden en Enemies, it's just a good read. So... God bless you. I'll talk with you later in Jesus. Live for God.